Electrical energy is used for everything in our lives, from the device that you are using to watch this video, to move a whole family in an electric vehicle, but is not only positive. According to some international reports, in 2021, energy industry emits 36.3 billions of tons of CO2. That's why it is important to pay attention to a green way to produce this vital resource. And there is where it still appears. Uh, in the case of wind energy, all the, the, the wind farms and the, the generators are made of, of steel. So as in, in other areas, uh, steel is a key material. For example, it needs steel for producing the entire structure of a wind turbine since the years to support for the blades. This becomes more astonishing if you consider that the wind energy industry was responsible for producing more than 8 megawatts in 2021. Still, it's a key material for solar farms. Basically, solar panels are mounted in steel structures. Uh, all the transmission lines uh, require uh, a lot of steel uh, to, to build uh, the infrastructure. If you have ever seen a solar power plant, probably notice that all of the solar panels are a standing structure that is made of galvanized steel. This is because this kind of steel has a great resistance against the elements and UV rays, which is important since the solar panels need to be outside for producing energy. Well, it's the same case for nuclear energy. Uh, the, the buildings uh, are made of concrete and steel, mainly. In 2021, more than 10% of the total world energy was produced by the nuclear power plants. This makes the nuclear energy the most important green power and it also needs steel to exist, because not only makes an important part of the structure of a plant, but also it's part of the fusion reactors. All the power conversion equipment is mainly a build of steel. The reduced activation of ferritic martensitic steels or RAM steels is currently the most used material to contain all the power produced by the fusion reaction, turning the steel into a key factor because its adequate mechanical properties, behavior under its radiation, compatibility with other materials and cooling media, and radiological properties. In the future, the nuclear energy is going to be the principal way to produce energy to its low impact to the environment and its big rate of production. That's why this industry will require more steel, not only rough steel, but all other kinds of steel used in the energy industry, becoming the steel into a pillar for a green energized future.